So it's Sunday the 29th of November, uh, so this video goes up today, so I've got to work fast. It's really windy outside, and it was my birthday yesterday, which I got this, courtesy of Jack Smith. That is so cool. Now look at that. It's like spacey, and this is, this is so cool. That's so cool. Sam, Sam got me this. Um, it's a gorilla pod, which is also so cool. I was actually just had it on there, sending pictures and stuff. That's cool. Um, anyway, um, this isn't a uh, <coughs> unboxing. Not an unboxing. This isn't a uh, Ben's birthday haul video. So, anyway. So last week I got you guys to vote on what my next video would be, and the thing you voted for the most was types of people on Instagram. So, if you don't know what Instagram is, then you're obviously old because it's everywhere. Instagram is basically Twitter with pictures. So hello people of the internet, my name is Ben Saunders and today I thought I'd make a video on types of people on Instagram. Let go! Number one, the foodie. Now the foodie, much like the same person in my Snapchat video, is the person that spends all of their time making Instagram accounts to take pictures of food. So this person would go out and buy food and then let it go cold because they're spending so much time rearranging it artistically to then upload it to their fellow food lovers. Number two, the Thema. Now the Thema is a person that would uh, upload any picture to Instagram, it's fine, as long as it either has a certain border, a certain look, or a certain colour swatch. Is that is that the right word? Is it colour swatch or colour swatch? Mm. Take my mate Sam Wallen for example, he has a theme. I hope he's doing that on purpose, but anyway, he does. Maybe it's the contrast or the brightness levels, but either way, the photos are similar in one way or another. Number three. The fangirl. Now the fangirl will usually have two Instagram accounts, one of them being personal and one of them which they use to post pictures of Joe Sugg. If you go onto YouTuber's followers, the majority of their followers are probably fan accounts. Number four, the fake user. Now the fake user, okay, he gets annoying and he's hard to spot, but if you want to buy followers, then he's there in an instant. For example, coming all the way in from South Asia, we have Sajid, who's only got one photo, 12 followers, and is only following one person, which is yourself, because you paid him to. Number five. The Quota. Now, the Quota is someone who can't upload a photo without actually staring into people's souls. For example, if we go onto a common user by the name of Ben underscore internet, link in the description, go onto a photo that he posted seven weeks ago, and the caption is as follows. It all just disappears, doesn't it? Everything you are in a moment. Life is full of jealousy and envy and longs for the lives of others. It feeds on the memory of love and loss and birth and death and joy and sorrow. We live in a world in which the laws of physics are said to be devised by the mind of a madman. Life has things that we wouldn't believe. It has lost things that we will never understand. It knows secrets that must never be told, knowledge that must never be spoken. But that's life. Thank you very much. Number six. The filter guy. This is the person that could upload the best photo in the world, but it wouldn't matter because their needs are to edit it so much that it looks like a piece of poo poo. For example. Number seven, the tagger. Now this is the person that gets their followers from tagging a photo so much that it is pretty much impossible not to see. For example, hashtag happy, hashtag sad, hashtag photo, hashtag video, hashtag Instagram. Hashtag outside, hashtag cloud porn. Number eight, the I don't give a damn. Uh, now the person I refer to is the I don't give a dammer. Yeah, this is the person that doesn't care what other people think. They feel they don't need to delete photos. No starting new feeds, none of that. Where all their friends have five photos, they have over 2,000. And I respect that, to be honest. And finally, number nine. The YouTuber. The YouTuber is the person that spends their life making YouTube videos and supplying pictures for their fellow fans. The YouTuber's pictures will vary from pictures with their friends, to artistic pictures, to world famous pictures of their pug. And then occasionally you'll get that screenshot of their new video saying, new video link in the bio, hashtag internet melt 6 million. Okay. I think that's about it. So like I said last week, I got you to vote on what my next video is. I'm not going to do that this week because next week is BMS, so look out for that. What I'm going to say is though, if you want me to do that voting thing again, then in the comments, just type yes. Just just type, I just need a yes, okay? That's all I want from you. Do that, 
and I'll sleep happily. Anyway, so thank you for watching guys. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you are new. Anyway guys, thank you once again and I will see you next time. Goodbye.